Good people. What's up? Let's go. Happy Wednesday. Happy hump day. It's a beautiful day. I'm on this little stroll. That's out of the neighborhood. Hey, I've been thinking. So every Tuesday I meet with, uh, we call it our dream team. And uh, we kind of, actually kind of, we share out what we've been doing last week, what we accomplished, any challenges, struggles, setbacks we had, we put it on the table and then everybody just starts assisting with solving the problem, right? Uh, then we share out what we're looking to do and if we need any help connecting with anyone getting a project done we figure out how to get that done for each other and one of the things we talked about was kind of like when do you let your dream know what do we say can you change your dream that's what it was can you change your dream like if you're having a dream and it's not come into life how you envision it um is it okay to change up absolutely i think absolutely you can you can pivot uh one thing i said as i was sharing out with the group was don't let the dream kill you don't let your dream kill you what does that mean sometimes you know you go all in on this dream you may sell the house you may take out a second third mortgage uh, you may deplete your your savings, your 401k, all to fund this dream. But despite all that effort, financial commitment, time commitment, you're not getting the results that would equate to what you put in. So your ROI, return on investment, is not healthy. It's not looking good. What do you do? Well, <laughs> I'm not the smartest guy in the world. But I think there has to come a point where you say, you know what, self? So we got to pivot or shut it down. Now, remember, shutting it down isn't a bad thing. I started a hair company many moons ago. I don't got no hair, but I could sell some Brazilian, that kinky curly. Ooh, woo, woo. Listen, Peruvian. But anyway had that going for about three four years and then decided damn this this is killing us shut it down now i didn't think it was a loss yeah we lost money yeah we lost time i can't get back but the lessons learned like now i know i go start a hair company now and probably crush it for sure because i'm not going to do five grand or was it three or five grand in hair in the basement with no sales, no pre-orders. That's not gonna happen. I'm not not gonna have a, a voice, uh, a trusted voice in the hair space to vouch for my products. It's not gonna happen. I'm gonna do things so different, but I wouldn't know that unless I went through the storm. Hello, hello. And then now, after that business shut down, I started another one. And now I take the skills, the lessons that I learned from the hair business and I apply it to the new business. Boom, that's the source. So, don't let the dream kill you. It's all right to pivot. And it's all right to shut it down. Take some time, take a step back, take a beat, and then bounce back. Do you remember good people? It's all about you. Yeah, yeah.